Welcome back to the Queen of Budget. This video is just a little bit different. I'm not doing an Operation Christmas Child unboxing, but I am going to show you what I was able to get for $9. So I was at three, there were three different places that I got things. Uh, the first was the Dollar Tree. The second was garage sales, and then the third was the Goodwill outlet where you pay by the pound. So I'm going to start out with what I got at the Dollar Tree. So just one thing, um, but they have these three packs of water bottles, and they are uh, BPA-free. They're little. You're able to fit a lot of um like things in it still. Um, and normally they come in packs of two, but right now they have packs of three for a dollar. Um, so I grabbed one of those. My next um, is what I got when I was at some garage sales. So I got this new with tags. Um, sure, it was just originally from Walmart, but it's a Christmas shirt. Um, size small, adult small, or junior size small. So I'm going to put this in a 10 to 14 year old and hope that it goes to a uh, 10 to 14 year old girl. And this was 50 cents at a garage sale. Then I got this bag of cars. And I got five new Hot Wheel cars for um, for a dollar. So that was pretty exciting. That's 20 cents a piece for those. More from a garage sale. I got um, their little felt pieces, um, trucks, um, got a step light, railroad crossing, um, bus, and then this is the one I'm excited about. It's um, a train and we have the little train station and then the train tracks. And I got this at a garage sale for a quarter. And then this was also very exciting. Um, I got five brand new boxes of colored pencils and then a pack of 12 uh, regular pencils that comes with a sharpener. And I got all six of these for a dollar, which is pretty incredible deal. And then the last thing I got, I don't know, I'm still debating if this was a good deal or not. Um, but I got eight bars of soap for a dollar. Um, so these are the ones that normally like you would get at a hotel. Um, they're still, they're, they're new in box or whatever. So I got eight bars of soap for a dollar. Um, most of the time I like to get ivory because these do have like a mild smell and, um, I don't like having soap with smells in my boxes, so I'm still deciding um, if that was a good deal or not. And then the last things that I got was at the Goodwill outlet, and that is where you pay by the pound. So I got three pounds of stuff, and it's $1.39 a pound, and so this is what I got um, for three pounds. Um, so I got brand new king-size pillowcases. If you watched one of my videos before, I um, one of my mom's friends turns pillowcases into dresses. Um, so this is just a purple, um, but she'll add like some lace at the bottom. And um, I also thought it would be fun to, you know, be able to add some color, but I also know that, you know, underneath these, they're not gonna see through because they are um, this dark purple. Um, so I'm pretty excited about those. Um, I got a pair of little boy shorts, um, four years old. Um, just little shorts, new with tags for a two to four year old boy box. Then I got, I'm pretty excited about these as well. Um, 
They're like little building blocks. I thought these would be great for um, two to four year old. They're like magnetic and they can build with them. They're really sturdy. Um, and these are in brand new condition. There's squares, there's little triangles. Um, let's see. I guess that's, there's just little triangles and um, and squares, but there's a ton of them. So I thought that this could kind of be a wow gift for a two to four year old little boy. In one of my other videos, I had like a unicorn horse theme and I had the big one of this um, seahorse. And so I am going to find room to get the little baby one in there. So it's pretty exciting little find. Uh, a brand new little teeny elephant here. And then I have brand new um, the moose chocolate growing up. He was my favorite. And I also have um, the little one as well. So um, good to have the mom and baby. Um, as I've also said in other videos, I have been liking to put uh, the 10 to 14 year old girl underwear in some sort of like little container, um, little bag. And so I got one of these little Ipsy bags um, and it's so soft um, to be able to put her underwear in. Um, and then once she's used it, you know, she can use it for other things, school supplies, um, just to keep her her treasures in. Uh, the next things are um, some Barbie clothes. Um, so I always look for Barbie clothes and see if there's any in like perfect condition. And I found just lots and lots of Barbie clothes in um, just absolute perfect condition. Um, some of them, I found a lot of bottoms. So I'll have to kind of look for some tops, but super excited about all of those. I love to add um, extra clothes to the Barbies that I get so that um, the little girl's able to change. Um, I got a little basket. I thought it would be fun to put in with the Barbies, um, you know, put a little animal or something in there. Um, so her Barbie's able to, to play with that. Um, oh, more Barbie clothes. Then I got a bunch of stickers, um, so I'll put those just at the bottom. Um, Winnie the Pooh, some some bear ones. Then I got this little little panda backpack. Um, not super big, um, but just can put a few toys in there. And then there's like a little clip on there, um, so I thought that was super adorable. And then just a, a little toy here as a filler. And then um, I came across uh, a huge box of crayons, like the, is it 96 or something? Opened it up and there was a bunch of crayons in there that were brand new. So they have never been used. Some of them had. So I took out all the ones that were brand new and I will just put them in some sort of little bag um, so that they can have some crayons. I then got, there's a few more, I don't know where they are. Um, these brand new little bows, they were still like on the little packages um, that they came from from the store. Um, so those will be fun. Oh, here's the other one. And another one. Then I got this cute little baby. Super cute. Great little filler, I think. Um, and then I got a baseball. A deck of cards. Two shooter marbles. Um, so I've seen that the Dollar Tree has marbles but they don't come with any shooters. So I got two shooters. I got this little kit here and it has pins 
and safety pins. Um, so I'll be able to put those in my little sewing kit. Um, a pair of little Barbie boots. And I'm pretty sure that these were um, frozen from Princess Elsa, or no, Princess Anna. And then the last thing is a um, brand new drawstring backpack um, that I'll be able to put in one of my girl boxes for her to put her school supplies in. Um, so those are the items that I got between the Dollar Tree, uh, garage sales, and the Goodwill outlet. Um, so I'm super excited with all the brand new items that I was able to get at a fraction of the price that you normally would get them for. Um, so super excited to be able to fill some more boxes with some amazing deals. Um, if you ever go to garage sales or um, the Goodwill and you find new things for your boxes, I would love to hear what kind of things that you are able to find.